die right now. Look at what Lemon took. He took the Holy Baptism. Maybe he's trying to cancel out Kyrie's heavy spin, but look at T-Boy, he's gonna get engaged on Holy Baptism by himself as Silence pops down to Entropy, dealing so much onto Vin, taking half of the tank's HP. Skylar trying to get that weakness point onto Keyboy. Cheeky, cheeky little first ability, but no, no follow-up just as of right now. Lemon! Oh my god, he jumps in with the Holy Baptism, almost catching CW. That was what it was for, and R7 zones them back for RRQ, the rest of them to take the Lord for free. Brilliant by Lemon. My goodness. No punishment. Right now with the Lord coming in, RRQ go for the final play. Let's see, once again, Enhanced Lord here in the mid lane. Onik with the Entropy, with everything, they have the high ground, they're gonna go for it. Final blow to the back lines, Kyrie's taking low, but he's still gonna cross wall tag, taking Kyrie down, taking Keyboy down, everyone melting on the hands, on the feet of RRQ. Sans trying to defend once again, the minions are still there. Sans figuring out where nature is gonna be popped there, that's gonna be the base target, and that's gonna be the equalizer for RRQ. They come back, and it's an equalizer. It's game three in the Royal Derby. I mean, wow. I, I I, had a feeling that this was going to happen. Arki Hoshi, they're so quick. Be able to just read or even just evaluate, reevaluate the mistakes that they made in game number one. And that was so close for a moment. Woo! But Arki Hoshi with the outplays, with the micro skills, the macro skills, the lemon outplay as well was a huge turnaround for them.